Well, the Trump administration just came out and stopped this merger dead in its tracks, and I want to talk about some of the details here pertaining to this. What Trump just did is he signed an executive order, is what he did. And you can read that over here. He did this yesterday for those that missed it. And in this order, what he's basically saying is that he's stopping the merger of Qualcomm and its rival Broadcom, citing that this could impair the national security of the United States. Huawei, or however you say it, the company, the Chinese company that is at the heart of this, they are saying that in the end, if they don't make moves now, that they will, they will be stuck buying Chinese products down the road. This is a situation they do not want to be in. And this is what they're saying here as far as this goes here on the world stage. Now, they're citing this is all about China and this race for 5G. We've talked about the 5G from coast to coast here in the United States and the technological race between the United States and other countries as it is. We talked about the hypersonic military weapons uh, that are being talked about by Russia, the United States, and China. But in this instance, you're talking about two big companies that were wanting to come together, and they just absolutely are not having it. They're saying if this was to happen, it would put the United States in a bad position. So anything that comes along business-wise like this, you can expect them to make moves similar to this uh, in the future. But I wanted to clarify it, let it be known what this was all about, who was involved and that there was actually an executive order attached to this. So, I'll leave links and I'll update with more info as things change. This has been Dabu7.